What is up everybody? I'm Motopilot and yes, I am selling my 2016 Aprilia RSP4RR. I know a lot of you are going to ask me, why are you selling it? It's a great amazing bike and it is. I'm going to miss this machine, but honestly, I'm just not using it. And I figure someone else can appreciate it more than me. And uh, so I'm going to let it go. Now this bike is super tricked out. It's got a lot done to it. It's got about 16,000 easy miles. The thing just rips. If you've never ridden Aprilia, this is the most exciting machine you'll ever ride. The sound of it, the way it handles, the power delivery, it's just, it's, it's insane, really. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm just kind of brief over some of the things I did to it. It's got the SC Project exhaust, the most beautiful exhaust I think you can get for this bike. Titanium, it's way lighter than stock. The thing is super mean. I'll start it up at the end of the video, but um, to put one of those on your bike, you're looking at about 877 bucks. And I got the butterfly valve open, and I do have the race ECU to go with that. Race ECU is going to cost you around 760 bucks. Check out the wheels on this thing. These are not the RR wheels. These are the RF wheels, the factory wheels. They're the much lighter wheels, front and back. Made a huge difference on this bike in handling when you get rid of that centrifugal weight. Even at 30 miles an hour, this bike is more nimble it turns quicker you put a set of these rf wheels on your bike you're looking at a minimum 1500 bucks got a little wave rotor back there on the back has the beautiful italian geomoto rear sets these are beautiful pieces they're around 445 bucks for a set of those now one thing i want to mention about this bike it does have rf graphics on it these are not the stock graphics the way this bike looked when it came it was like that the matte silver two-tone matte silver if you don't like this look and you want to change it you can peel these off and you'll have that stock graphics. But if you like them, it looks like you have the RF machine with all these cool sponsored logos on here. You know, sponsored by Speed and Strength and Competition Works, T-Rex. You got Geomoto, Moto Composites. Got my number. It's got the chrome. It's actually chrome graphics. It's not silver, it's chrome. Let's go over the $1,150 of carbon fiber on this thing real quick. Start at the top, you've got this tank cover. You got these panels here. The entire front fender is carbon fiber. Come down here. Back fender is carbon fiber. These side panels here, all carbon fiber. And you even have a little carbon fiber piece right there. Come around here to the other side. Chain guard's carbon fiber. And the lower guard down there is carbon fiber too. Here's your other rear set here. It's got the uh, automatic upshift, auto blip upshift. Not downshift, just up. Back here is the Competition Works Blinker Integrated LED Tail Light. Much cleaner than stock. That's about 160 bucks. We eliminated the uh, back tail on this thing. Competition Works also. That's like $117. Check out that license plate. Can you believe I scored that? This bike is also covered in T-Rex armor. I've got these T-Rex spools back here and axle blocks. You come up here. Got the engine guard. You got your sliders here. I will see everything's on both sides. Come up to the front axle. Got the axle sliders. Let's come around here. It's cool how they have the blinkers in the mirrors. Let's turn that off. Come over here. Obviously, you got another slider. I got a GoPro mount on there in case you ever want to run a GoPro. Got one down there. Got one up there. And uh, there's the other engine cover there. I really like their engine covers. They're, to me, they're the best looking engine cover out there. Got a nice set of billet levers here. These are adjustable. If you want the lever closer to your hand, you just turn this dial right here. Back and forth. Check it out. I like mine all the way out because I got big hands. Um, here's what the dash looks like. If you turn it on, you can see the race ECU. It'll say race on here. See right there, it says race. Can you see that? Uh, it's got the uh, double bubble Puig shield. Puig shield. I love that shield. Does a great job. Front end looks like it's got my logo on here. You know, you could. I could even have another sticker made for you if you wanted to, the, the graphics, but you want my name taken off there. Got my little star on there. That's not a problem. The bike has got a fresh set of meats on it. I'm running the. Uh, I'm running the Metzler M7RR tire on there. These things are like brand new. I just put them on. I did just put on this sprocket and chain. It's the uh, EKA gold chain. And uh, Super Sprocks makes that sprocket, I think. I don't even remember. But uh, that's all fresh. 
and as a bonus, uh, the bike's going to come with these stands, a set of T-Rex stands, one for really nice stands, one for the back, you got one up here for the front, it's just kind of sitting there. So, the bike has got everything, dude. Got little details, got these little red screws, just for uh, accents, and uh, special edition, baby. Let's start this thing up so you can hear it. Yes, Switch out. miss that sound so much anyways guys if you want the bike send me an email motopilot6 at gmail.com I'm not gonna tell you guys how much I want for the bike it's got like a reserve that's in my head and whoever gives me the, the, the best number can get the bike so if you send me an email make me an offer if uh, I'll let you know where your offer stands if somebody emails me a higher offer I will let you know what that is so it's kind of like eBay without eBay you know what I mean? So there is a reserve. If I don't get the reserve, I just won't sell it. I don't need to sell the bike. I just want to sell it. Motopilot6 at gmail.com. Good luck. See ya. Here's the bike again. Uh, it's really hard to let this thing go, man. It is a beautiful, beautiful machine.